In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to fix this error. Common raw score not found. So if you type raw score in a terminal and you get command raw score not found, but can be installed with this sudo apt install python3 ros launch, well, don't execute this command because this is not the solution to this error. Usually you will get this error because you haven't sourced your environment for ROS. So what do I mean by that? Let's say you have correctly installed ROS. So here on my environment, I use Ubuntu 20.04 and ROS Noetic. So if you go to slash opt slash ROS Noetic, you can see that ROS Noetic is installed on my computer here. So if you use Noetic, you go on opt ROS Noetic. If you use Melodic, then you change Noetic to Melodic and the same for Kinetic, for example. So if you want ROS core command and any ROS run command after that to work, you will have to source that setup.bash script. So if I do source setup.bash, okay, inside this folder, okay, and then I do ROS core again, this will work. And I press Ctrl C to kill the ROS master. So this is the fix to that problem, not not this, okay? This is not the fix to the problem. So now you have seen that you can go to this directory and source the setup.bash, but you can also from any directory, source slash opt ROS noetic. So you replace with whatever ROS version you have and then setup bash. Okay, and this will do the same. Now, if we open a new terminal, well, what will happen is that you will get the same error. So you need to source opt ros noetic setup bash in every terminal that you open. And if you don't want to do that manually, well, you can simply add this line here to the bash rc. So let's go to the bash rc with jdit bash rc. So the bash rc is located in your home directory and then dot bash rc. This is the name of the file. Okay, so this is the bash rc. You don't touch anything here. You go at the end of the bash rc and we are going to copy and paste this command here. So copy and paste that here. You can save the bash rc. Okay, close the bash rc and now let's close all terminals. Let's open a new one. The bash rc will be executed first thing when you open the terminal and then it works. All right, if you like this video, subscribe to get more tutorials like this in the future. Also, check out my online courses to learn ROS1 and ROS2 step by step in an efficient way by practicing and directly going to the point. Links in the description. Thank you for watching. See you in the next tutorial or in one of my courses.